Greetings guys, it's your boy Jeff Peter and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'll be taking you through my full day of eating. As we all know, diet is the key in building muscles or losing weight. If you wish to build muscles, you need to be on a calorie surplus and if you wish to lose weight, you need to be on a calorie deficit. Without not taking much of your time, let's go into my full day of eating. To begin with, I practice IF. I fast for 18 hours and I eat within 6 hours. In those 6 hours, I eat every after 2 hours and I eat 3 times. Whereas in those 18 hours, while fasting, I usually work out twice, morning and afternoon section. Morning, I do my cardio and afternoon section, I do my weight lifting. On the screen, yeah, these are the ingredients for my breakfast. This is the after photo and these are the macro nutrients. I love this meal. With this my food day of eating guys, this is what I've been having for the past one year. Like for example, it counts like 90% of my meal because it is cheap, it is I can see the ingredients in any market I go to or any more I go to. It is not complicated and easy to cook. For example, this is my breakfast. You don't need to spend much time in the kitchen. You go to the kitchen only to boil your eggs. As you can see from the ingredients, 3 hard boiled eggs, 50 grams of oats, 1 medium apple, 3 100 milliliters of milk, one scoop of whey protein. This meal is very easy to make. Once you boil your eggs, you just need to. I don't cook my oat. Yes, I don't cook my oat. When I measure my 50 grams of oat, I add my one scoop of whey protein, my milk. I try to stir to make it smooth. Then I add my my, my dice apple and I'm good to go okay guys without not taking much of your time I'm going to have this meal and I'm going to see you at lunch until then bye okay guys welcome back it's lunch time two hours after I lastly had my breakfast, this is a very simple meal. These are the ingredients. This is the after photo. And these are the macro nutrients. Guys, this meal is very easy to, to make. Once you bake your chicken breast and your sweet potato, believe me, you have just 10 minutes to be in the kitchen. As you can see from the ingredients, I have already prepared my chopped carrots and my broccoli with chopped tomato. I bake my sweet potato and I bake my chicken breast. When they are all ready, I just add butter into the frying pan. I add my ginger and garlic. My tomato after three minutes I add my steam carrot and broccoli I don't do salt and guys I eat only butter olive oil and coconut oil the only times I eat vegetable oil is when I go to visit a friend or on my cheap days guys cooking with butter it gives it that aroma which i love so much and for me it makes it it makes the food delicious with good aroma so guys this is very easy meal 200 grams of chicken breast 200 grams of baked sweet potato 100 gram of broccoli 100 gram of 100 grams of carrot and you are good to go a very simple delicious and nice meal it does not take it does not take you a lot of time in the kitchen 
Okay guys, I'm going to enjoy this meal and see you at dinner. Until then, bye for now. Delicious. Okay guys, welcome back. It's dinner time. It's been two hours since I had my lunch and this is the last meal for the day. As you can see on the screen, these are the ingredients. This is the after photo. Guys, this meal is very easy to make. From the ingredients you saw, three eggs, 200 grams of chicken breast, tomato and spices. We don't use all the eggs. We use just the, the egg white to make this meal. These are the macro nutrients. Guys, I love this meal so much. I've been having this meal for the past one year now and every day it just it just keep getting delicious i don't know why reason maybe because i love pizza so much so in making this meal i always think like i'm having pizza so this is my own form of pizza bed in chicken breast and egg white the meal is very easy to make you don't need lots of ingredients just two ingredients as you saw from from the photo chicken breast, egg white, tomato, onion, and spices. That's just all, and you are done with this meal. You fry for two minutes with butter, you flip, and you fry the other side for two minutes, and you are good to, to go. The meal is very delicious. Once I'm done with this meal, I then have this bowl of Greek yogurt, 150 grams of Greek yogurt, 20 grams of peanut. When I'm done with this meal, I conclude my day with this bowl of Greek yogurt and peanut. Once I'm done eating, then you saw already for my breakfast, I do three supplements. Whey protein, multivitamins and fish oil. When I'm done with this meal, I have my multivitamin and my fish oil and I'm done for the day. Guys, to sum it all, these are the total calories for the day for my full day of eating. This is what I have from Mondays to Fridays and on Saturdays, I try to switch up things. I can have this fish and on Sundays and I can have this barbecue which is lean lean beef so guys there you go that is my full day of eating hope this helps you it does not mean you have to it doesn't mean you have to eat like I'm eating as you can see from my calories it all depends on your goals like I said from the start if you wish to build muscles remember you need to go on a calorie surplus and if you wish to lose weight you need to go on a calorie deficit it all depends on you and your goals what you want this is just to give you an idea of how i ate living from being fat to being fit for my transformation video and guys if you can realize or if you've noticed in this my food of eating i try to eat one gram of protein per body weight and this is my last meal especially this plate chicken breast egg white no calorie no 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 carbs it has no carbohydrate i try to reduce my carbohydrate because my first and second meal i had carbs in them so for my last meal my carbohydrate comes from the greek yogurt and the peanut but this meal does not have carbohydrate as you can see for my total carbs so i don't do carbs a lot i'm always on a low carb diet
high protein with fat. I prefer that it has worked for me. So it is only to it's for you to look for what works for you. It doesn't mean that you have to eat like me. I'm just trying to give you an idea of what I've been eating. Okay, guys, I'm going to end there for today. If you found this video interesting, please like, share, and subscribe. Until then, see you in my next video. Bye.